Hey everybody, welcome back to the Old Swedes Farm. I want to talk to you about something you're going to encounter if you get chicks. And that is pasty butt or poopy butt. Uh, I don't know if you can see. One of the more glamorous uh, things you're going to do with your chickens. And we've had a few. It's usually caused by stress. It's just that the they poop and it doesn't quite come out. It sticks to the chick um, and can cause it to back up, cause uh, some real problems, and the chick can actually die. What I've got is some warm water. Really watch what temperature you've got it. Not too hot, not too cold. I mean, you're gonna know when it's warm water. Um, your chick will really fight if it's too hot or too cold. Um, I have a little Epsom salt in there what I do is let them soak. What I'm trying to do is get that poop to, to soak and loosen, and then I'm going to rub it slightly. Is she falling asleep? She is. Wow. Um, Happy little I'm, girl. I'm gonna let that poop loosen, um, and you can feel it crumble. But I'm just gonna lightly rub her vent um, with that poop. If you pull at it, you could rip the skin, you could really do some damage. Wow, I've never had one fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't um, either. Um, she likes a good soak like everybody. Oh, yeah. um, you want to loosen that poop up and get it to crumble away. There you go. And you can uh, see some of it crumble as she moved. Um, there's still quite a bit back there. Um, let's see. You can see it's quite impacted. So I'm just going to rub back and forth in the water. Here, let's get you to fall asleep again. And then uh, eventually it'll fall up, fall off. I've got a little washcloth here. I'm gonna wrap her up and lightly dry her. Then I'm gonna get her under the heat lamp. Now you wanna watch her. This is a very light uh, feathered or light downy uh, chicken. When she gets back, she's gonna have her backside showing and that vent is red. Um, watch it so the other girls don't pick on her. She, They see something red and they wanna peck at it kind of guard her a little bit while she preens herself and gets herself ready. Otherwise, she could become a bloody mess and really have some issues. Um, infection or, I mean, could bleed and get picked on. So um, I'm just gonna work her and then get her back. Um, oh yeah, there you go. Everything kind of crumbled off. Let me just rinse her off. We can show the finished product. Um, not the most glamorous thing you're gonna do, um, but being a chicken owner is, I guess, the good and the bad. So I've got her, and there's her vent all, all clean off. We're going to get her, there you go, little honey. We're just going to get her wrapped up, and uh, I'm going to let her dry for a little bit, and then we're going to put her under, see if she'll fall asleep under the, under the heat lamp. Anyways, one of the more glamorous jobs you're going to get as a chicken owner, but uh, this will lead to a healthy girl and, and a whole bunch of eggs down the road. Thanks for watching, everybody. Cheers.